There's a Metro Detroit link to that huge credit card breach discovered at Home Depot last month. Two men from our area have been arrested with apparently some of that data, and it could be yours. Seven investigator Jim Kirstner live in Southfield tonight with the very latest for us. Jim. Yeah, Joanne, let's start at the top. 56 million do-it-yourselfers who use their credit or debit card nationwide at Home Depot had their personal information hacked, a lot of it being sold on the black market. That's where the two guys from Detroit could be connected. They probably going to be tied in with those people. We have not figured out where in the fraud ring they play a part. It's never one person. Stephen Parker of Detroit, Antoine Lee of Oak Park, both arrested outside of Houston. And they had with them not screwdrivers and drills, but 200 stolen credit cards, card swiping devices, hard drives, and worst of all, personal financial data. These individuals probably were sold the information. Stephen Parker has a West Side Detroit address. His family here told us no comment this afternoon. Antoine Lee lived here in Oak Park, a house now apparently in foreclosure. A legal notice posted on the front door and leftover mail in the box. Antoine Lee also has a local rap sheet pleading guilty to six counts of stolen credit cards. He was set for sentencing this past Tuesday, but was already in custody in Texas. The local police there have called in the feds going through all of the personal data found with the two guys from Detroit. Hundreds of thousands of people that we have probably saved at least a small portion of their monies. That's the good news, but hundreds of thousands of 56 million, that's a small drop in the bucket. Police say they may have more information for all of us by next week, and this is a good reminder that information is still out there. Check your own accounts. I'm live in Southfield, Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News. Thanks, Jim. We turn now to new information.